Hello and welcome to what looks like a cooking show, except that it's not. This is how I make my warm chow. Melinda, this is for you. You asked to see my recipe, so here it is. So I use rolled oats, which I then use the magic bullet that makes quick work of the oats into this nice flaky stuff. I use flour, not self-rising. I use cornmeal, gluten-free, organic, nothing but the best for my worms, right? Honestly, you can use whatever you want. Uh, Eggshells and coffee grounds. Now, you can use any measurement you want. Typically, I go one cup of rolled oats, one cup of flour, uh, two cups of cornmeal, uh, half a cup of pulverized eggshells, and just a little bit, quarter cup, half a cup, whatever you want, of the um, used coffee grounds. And uh, this is what I do. It's really, really quite, quite easy. Just put it all together. You can make more and you can make less and just keep it in a container and use it when you want to. You can use it by itself. You can use it as a supplement to your, um, to your kitchen scraps. Oh, great. Why am I using my, I'm using my left hand. Um, and this is it. This is the recipe. I just mix it all together and, um, and let it sit and just use it when I, when I need to. The, the, the worms really uh, is an experiment for me. I'm not feeding a lot of it, so this goes a long way. But if you um, want to feed a lot of it to your worms, because you have a lot of worms, by all means, make some extra. It takes no time at all. And uh, keep it in a large container and feed it to your worms. And that's it. How easy is that? So that's my worm chow recipe. Of course, you can use, instead of eggshells, you can use um, oyster shell, you can use um, uh, diatomaceous earth and anything, uh, azomite, anything that adds grit and uh, a pH buffer for, for your bin. Uh, you can add wheat flour, um, whatever, whatever flour you, you have, whatever you want, play around with it and um, come up with your own, own uh, ideas. Um, Cause um, I think, I think they like it. I really do. Um, I mean, who doesn't like corn and flour? Oats, I do. So this is it. I hope you enjoy it.